And I'm curious how you're defining cultural blackness since you tend to use that as a springboard as you move into your three areas of thought. Could you define that or elaborate on what you mean since culture is such a complex entity? Yeah. I was watching TV some years ago and I was looking at the screen um, turned down. I watch a lot of TV. And there's this black man on the screen on some show. And on the bottom, it said astrophysicist. And I thought, and I turned it up. That's the only, I'll bet he's the only one. I'll bet. I'm just making a guess. Maybe there are two. I thought, what does a black astrophysicist have to say? And I also took a guess. I thought, if he's in that field, I hadn't even turned up the TV yet. I thought, if he's in that field, he is not going to be what most of us would think of as authentic. And I don't know what that means to you, but I think there's a common core, and I often hear the term used. It's not rooted. And I turned it up, and according to what many African Americans might think of this man, he was not. I later met him by chance. He has no evidence of black folk speech in his speech. He doesn't do it with the hair. He doesn't do it with the dress. Nothing. I've talked to him. Race issues never came up. He's just not in it. What I mean by culturally black and the connection with education is that all too often, if you're going to resist that peer pressure, you become an Oreo cookie. And we all know what it means, and I know I'm not supposed to use the term, but that's what happens. You're going to be called it, and if there's a such thing, you are that. Because you end up having to spend most of your time with people who are committed to school as you are. And isn't it a tragedy that across the country, the tendency is that you're not going to find a group of black kids like that. You might find one. I was pretty good at finding the one. There really might not be one. So that's what I mean by it's a part of black identity. Either you do it, or you're going to have a hard time sticking with the group. So unfortunately, we end up with this disconnect between nerd, or you know, the proportional amount of nerds that any culture ought to have. Not everybody's going to be a nerd. And what we think of as us. That's what I mean.